So uh, here we are today processing film. Um, uh, that reel, this is a Patterson tank. These things have been around for as long as I can remember anyway, probably 30 years. Um, and strangely, there doesn't, like technology has moved zero in terms of processing film. Uh, it's exactly the same as it was when I was in high school, which was quite some time ago. Um, today we're gonna process some 120 film because that's all I have. Um, and I'm just gonna show you how to load it onto the spool really quickly. This is, I guess this is a roll of color film but, and we're doing black and white, but uh, it's all I had scrap film lying around because uh, I'm gonna fog it right now when I show you how to do this. Uh, this first step in terms of loading the film needs to be done in complete darkness. And there's no good way to describe how to get this onto this, except to say it takes a lot of practice, especially 120 film. 35 is easier, but it just takes practice. And you're in a dark room and trying to get it on can be hugely frustrating and a real challenge. And in many cases, it's just a matter of trying it until you get it. But uh, I'll give you a few tips anyway, uh, at least what I've learned. First of all, when you load film, everything must be completely dry. That means the spool needs to be totally dry, like not even kind of a little bit wet, bone dry, hands need to be dry, uh, everything else needs to be dry because the minute, the instant the film uh, is wet or damp, it gets sticky and it will not, and I mean will not move on the spool, everything has to be super dry. So I'm gonna try and do this with my eyes closed to make it a little bit more of a challenge. Uh, you have your roll of exposed film and you crack open the, if I can get it here, crack open the, um, uh, the seal that you sealed. And then uh, 120 film has two pieces. Uh, one is a, is a roll of backing, it's backing paper. And as you unspool, you get to the film, which is that there. Don't mix them up. I've heard of people rolling the backing paper onto the, onto the spool and uh, processing the backing paper. So anyway, so you just, I just unspool it until I get to the end of the film, which is taped to the paper. And you do not want to peel the tape off the paper because amazingly, and I have actually had this happen, if you peel the tape off, when the tape separates from the film, it actually will, if you do it hard enough, will actually create some light and you'll fog your film. It's actually kind of cool, but uh, you can ruin a frame doing that. So I just tear it, tear it off. Make sure the paper's out of the way. Grab your spool. And what you're feeling for are the two biggest bumps on the spool. And the two biggest bumps are uh, facing, uh, or the facing towards you. So they, they go in and then they go out like that. And then what you wanna do is you wanna take the end of the film and you wanna put it between the spools. Now I'm a left-handed, so I'm doing this left-handed, but it's the same thing with your right. And what you need to do, and now you need to fight it until it goes on straight. And you wanna have the edge of the film square to the, the spool and then you pull it on and you make sure it doesn't go anywhere. And then you just wanna gently roll it on and there's little ball bearings in there that will hold the film. And you just, with your fingers, put it on like that, that's it, it's on. Now I've done that like a thousand times. So, um, but sometimes it takes forever, even, you know, even now for me. Uh, this is the stack, this is the middle part of the spool, goes in, doesn't matter which way, goes into the container, your lid goes on and your lid goes in and it must snap because if it doesn't snap, then it's not locked and you turn it over, it'll fall apart and you'll ruin your film. And then what I do is I take my finger and I stick it in there to double check to make sure that I can feel the middle part just on the super duper off chance. And then what I do is I give a little wiggle to make sure it's, make sure it's there. So it is. So that's it, your film is now loaded and now we process.